Boom! Here comes a hot step. A word up. I'm a lyrical gangster. Word up. Excuse me, Mr. Osfo. Word up. Still word up. Still love it like that. I act like you know you. Whatever the fuck. Hey, what's up? It's it's this. Talk about what's on my mind. The uh, here's a weird thing. I got an argument uh, with my friend Vic. Because he was all concerned that they're changing the uh, logo for Starbucks. Which, I, once I started thinking about it, I realized I'd been at Starbucks like two times in my life. And I'd only actually ordered something once. And I, I had a uh, an Arnold Palmer at the one by Wrigley one time when I was there for a meeting. And it was fine. I mean, it was just fine. It's lemon, lemonade and iced tea. Hard to fuck up no matter how many piercings and cylinders are, are in ya, but, uh, yeah, I was thinking about, like, I don't, I don't have anything against, uh, Starbucks or people that go to Starbucks, like, uh, you know, don't give a shit, you want to spend six, seven dollars on, on a Bente caramel whatever the shit you have, then, then do it, I'm fine with that, the thing is, like, they're just not convenient for me. Like, I don't find it convenient. That's the only reason I don't go there for more stuff. Like, on my way to wherever I go, there's not one. And I know there's places where there's, like, two of them across the street from each other. I never seem to go to places where that is, which is weird, I guess. Because it may, like, when you think about it, so many people, uh, whatever, it's such a phenomenon still to this day, and... It's just not something that's in... Like, it makes you feel real detached from the rest of society, I guess. I, I guess, like, I wouldn't... I don't drink coffee anyways. So if I went there, it would be only for Arnold Palmer's. And I kind of like just the brand that comes in the can better. So, oh, for a little closure, if, uh, yeah, we agreed that the coffee wasn't going to taste different because of the logo. All right. We'll see me later.